highlights from week number eight of the high school football season on Key City and FM 100. You see now more of the T formation in the backfield here for Starmont on what is first down and goal from the one yard line. Lowry with him under center, back over to Butler off left side between guard and tackle. Touchdown, got it. An impressive opening drive for Starmont. Jake Butler punches it in from one yard out. And Starmont takes the opening drive. They move right down the field, 68 yards. Butler the one-yard plunge, and the Stars lead 6-0. And Wapsie Valley with their first offensive possession. They operate from near the middle of the field, 39-yard line, I formation. O'Neal in the carry, big hole up the middle. 45-yard line, and O'Neal is in the open. Are you kidding me? 40, 30, 20, 10, gone. Touchdown, got it. On the first play from scrimmage, Tyler O'Neal goes over 1,000 yards and ties the ball game up. Sturman and Wapsie Valley now tied at six. First and goal on the one-yard line. So quickly, Babers with him under center in the I formation. And they are going to run the football with O'Neal. O'Neal hit the line of scrimmage, but able to roll ahead over the defender in for the score. Two touches, two touchdowns for Wapsie Valley. <laughs> O'Neal his second touchdown. And it's 13-6. to six. Wapsie Valley in the lead here. Just a little past midway through the opening quarter. First down, 10 yards to go. Lowry with him under center. Toss play right side to Butler. Butler, it's a halfback option play. Looking for a receiver. Moses sliding in the end zone. Does he have it? Touchdown. Got it. So Sturmont unloading the playbook. The hook and ladder for first down. Halfback option pass for a touchdown. Butler, 14-yard touchdown play to Moses. And with 23 seconds left in the half, it's now 14-12. First down, 10 yards to go. They're to the 14-yard line. They run the football with O'Neal. O'Neal first down inside the 10-yard line. Breaks through. 10-5. Dives in for the score. Touchdown. Got it. What an impressive drive by Wapsie Valley to start the second half. They take it 50 yards. Do it in a handful of plays. And with 10-33 left in the third, Wapsie Valley 20. Starmont 12. O'Neal's third touchdown. Receiver to the left there in Salisbury. Just caught that conversion pass moments ago after the touchdown run there by O'Neal. And they're on the football back to O'Neal. Left side. He's got first down inside the 30-yard line. Cut back across the middle. He's in the open. 20, 10, gone. Touchdown. Got it. 61-yard run earlier. 41-yard run here. And with 7.36 left in the third, Tyler O'Neill's fourth touchdown. 28-12, Wapsie in the lead. Bavers to throw the football, rolling out right, looking for Salisbury, covered. Bavers scampering towards the right sideline, back towards the middle. The outlet pass is O'Neill. O'Neill catches it. 10-5, goes in for the score. Touchdown, got it. Nothing open to the right. O'Neill, the safety valve on the left. Tyler O'Neill with his fifth touchdown. That is a reception of 11 yards. And it's now 35-12. Wapsie opening things up here in the third. Welcome to week number nine. Those days go by.